Go fire, so we'll stay there. Uh, that is helping the effort, obvious reasons to put out those flames, but it's also raising concerns in some other areas. Fox 40's Dennis Shanahan is live in Forest Hill to show us how that rain is impacting some of those burned out scar areas from the mosquito fire. Dennis. Well, today, Eric, I would say the rain was just right. It fell steadily for several hours, but not too heavy, heavily. It's that heavy rain that could make this more of a mixed blessing. Even as water flows throughout the mosquito fire burn scar, we saw flames in the rain, a sign of how stubborn a wildfire can be during a drought. And as you drive through the burned out forest, it's hard to tell whether you're looking at smoke from the fire or steam from the rain. Sometimes it's a combination of both. The rain is definitely helping to, to suppress the fire, but not quite enough to put so it. So as the temperatures go down and as humidity increases, the likelihood of fires continuing to grow or new fires, new spot fires starting decreases. So it decreases the probability that that fire will spread and fire will spread rapidly. Firefighter Andrew Dowd explained how the rain can present new challenges even as it helps the firefight. So with burn scars, our big concern is that the brush has been burned off of some of the topsoil, so the fine fuels have been burned off and even the roots underneath have been burned. And that can allow, with heavy rains, the mud to kind of slide down and debris and ash to slide down and, and, and slough off. It blocks the roads, makes the roads muddy, inaccessible. Firefighter Bud England explained while crews are still out in the woods battling the mosquito fire head on, they're keeping a close eye on the weather. Our, our biggest concern is firefighter safety. We're in steep canyons. Our firefighters are already struggling to get in and out of these canyons. You add rain, you add slippery slopes. It just makes it a, an unsafe environment. Nobody is complaining about the rain. We all know it's an awesome sight, even as it adds an eerie layer to an already moody landscape. Firefighters welcome it. They just don't want too much of it all at once. So as long as we don't get those heavy downpours, firefighters are welcoming this as an opportunity for this fire to at least be dampened a bit and it buys them some more time as they battle the front lines. Live in Forest Hill, Dennis Shanahan, Fox 40 News. Dennis